Odysseus is planned to land about 190 miles from the South Pole of the Moon. And this is an important location because it's one that the Artemis program and NASA are targeting as a site to potentially send humans to the moon. The spacecraft, uh, if it lands successfully, will be the first American spacecraft to land on the surface of the moon uh, since 1972, so over 50 years. Odysseus is going to teach us a lot about the moon, about technologies for landing on the moon, and then um, for surviving on the lunar environment, especially as we look to uh, build a more permanent base on the moon through the Artemis program that NASA is leading. And liftoff of Artemis 1, we rise together back to the moon and beyond. Odysseus is going to land in the middle of lunar day, so it'll be sunny and warm when it lands on the surface, um, but then after about a week, uh, it'll become lunar night, and so it will get cold, and the electronics aren't expected to survive how cold it will get. And then also it will um, go into nighttime, so the sun won't be up, and so it won't be able to power its solar panels anymore. There's so much more that we have to learn about the moon. Uh, everything from how it formed to the technologies needed to have people survive on the surface of the moon. So there's so much science and technology that we still have left to, to learn at the moon.